orphans who are served this is our cave from 360 reader. It's time to learn how to set the Finder default folder on Mac. Finder is a robust file manager on macOS, which runs pretty much all the time once you log into your system. It allows you to perfectly organize and locate all the files that are stored on your Mac. By default, launching the Finder window shows you all the recent files, but this can be changed if necessary. That said, let me show you how it's done the right way. First and foremost, head over to the Finder app on your Mac. After that, click on the Finder menu from the menu bar. Then choose Settings in the drop-down menu to continue. After that, ensure that the General tab is selected. This will launch a tiny new window on your Mac. Head over to the New Finder Window Show section and then click on the drop-down menu next to Recents. Now you will be suggested a few folders and storage locations. Click on the other option if you want to use a folder that didn't show up in the list. After that simply locate and select the exact folder that you want to use. And finally click on the choose option to set it as the default folder and that's pretty much it. From now onwards Finder will open the folder you selected instead of Reasons. Some users may prefer using documents at the default Finder folder so that they can quickly access their work-related PDFs, spreadsheets, and other important files. Others may want to use the home folder which houses all your desktop files, downloads, pictures, videos, music, and more. Now that you have found out how this macOS tip works, choose the desired folder as per your needs and that's all there is to it. So that's how you can easily set the Finder default folder on your Mac in macOS Sonoma or later. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy macOS tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.